Let's see what Ulf has to say. Welcome back, Master Detective. I see you believe me now. I believe you. I believe you have a beard. And why are the Mistwalkers attacking Dire Grove? Do you know who's responsible? Samuel, the head of the Hunters, clashes frequently with our leaders. He might be out for revenge. Or he wants your But awesome I'm not sure. If we bring an innocent to the spirit, its fury will know no bounds. The culprit must be guilty beyond a doubt. I was going to say that Samuel is attacking just to get the Mistwalker's awesome earrings. That's what I think. What if you sacrifice an innocent man? We prefer peaceful solutions, but sacrifice is sometimes necessary. The lives of many are at stake. We can't have the spirit's wrath spilling outside Dire Grove. We must find the one who is truly guilty. It is futile to discuss the punishment until then. I would suggest you check the hotel. Samuel has the key. He's a good friend of the owner. Okay, so if you haven't been paying attention so far, basically... Somebody desecrated the Sacred Grove, and uh, that's why the Mistwalkers are angry. They don't like it when people mess up with their... mess around in their Sacred Grove. It's good to have you back, Master Detective. I hope those bloody Mistwalkers didn't fill your head with lies. Mm, maybe... What's your take on all of this, Samuel? You can't trust those Mistwalkers. This cold is their doing. They're just looking for any excuse to use someone in their pagan rituals, especially that giant Bjorn. Why, I'd like to take that oath down a few notches. I'd like to investigate the hotel. Can you get me inside? The owner's a good friend of mine. Lucky for you, he left me the key. Here, take it. I've got nothing to hide. Be careful, though. The owner's particular about how the place looks. Okay. Don't be gone too long. It's only a matter of time before the Mistwalkers strike again. Fantastic. So now we can go inside the key and we start a new investigation into what's wrong with Samuel. Seems to have a pretty heavy grudge against the Mistwalkers. Probably because they, you know, adopted his son. What's this? Looks like a poster that Samuel made. We've got to hunt down these Mistwalkers and bring them to justice. We're entitled to their ancient legacy. Yeah. Ancient legacy, rawr, that's that should be our ancient legacy. So this is a weird looking thing. And this is going to be the front desk. Looks like we need three keys. And the manager is a little paranoid after the first game when we completely destroyed his hotel by breaking a hole through the roof. So he super locked his door to make sure we couldn't go inside. Unfortunately, the staircase is broken, so we won't be able to go upstairs like we did in the previous game. We still will be able to break things. Yeah! Oh, but I can't reach it. It's, it's too far down. I broke the radio. Alrighty, and over here to the left, we have another area. Uh oh, creepy music. Not to be confused with reindeer or snow deer. 
Uh, I, I think it's the spirit of the forest. It's the spirit of the forest, and it's mad because the forest was desecrated by a hunter killing innocent animals. Actually, the hunter was kidnapping innocent animals, too. A really nasty hunter. So we want to open that fireplace. Let's see, this, this is pretty blunt. We sharpen it up. And then we use it over here. Ah! Okay, so now, now we have a whistle, which is perfect. We can, we can use the whistle to whistle stuff. And that's a key. And apparently, axes can be used to destroy ice. I I didn't know that. But again, th then again, I don't live in a place which is anywhere near as cold as Dyer Grove. Dyer Grove is so cold, it reminds me of my ex-girlfriend. Mm. So, um... Where am I going now? I'm going back over here now that I have the wrench. This is totally a letter. It's a jigsaw puzzle. We need to figure out how this letter works. My wife, Lily, is dead thanks to them. They refused to help her. They might as well have killed her with their bare hands. And they took my son away. I will avenge my family. Ah. Okay, so they killed Lily with their bare hands, and that's why he hates the bear man. Bare hands, bear man. They sound similar. They sound similar enough, right? Very, very similar sounding words. So I know I want to use the screwdriver somewhere besides here. I just I just never remember where that screwdriver is supposed to be used. Is it supposed to be used here in the street? No, this is actually a place for an axe. And now, going back to puzzles we saw three videos ago. Hooray! Now we have that pole. So we can grab this. Ooh, that's a diary, and I remembered what it is I want to unscrew. It's right over here. Perfect. And what's inside this diary? Money. Oh, and that's the hotel owner. Okay, so that's the hotel owner's diary, which he keeps in the fireplace? I, I don't understand hotel owners sometimes. But hey, I got a cross thing. That's nice. Hint says I need to go inside. Actually, I have everything I need to solve this puzzle. So, magnetic key goes there. Hold on a second. Hold hold on a second. Ah! Okay. The game, the game is trying to get the jump on me. I'm trying to go all the way left in my inventory so I can get the key card. You know, the key card we've been hanging... We've been keeping around for a really long time. So, this is code 57824. And now we can get inside the manager's office. Now, the office is brand new. It doesn't look anything like it did in the previous game. Which is kind of a shame, but makes sense. What's this? Samuel isn't talking since. 
He's trying to whip up a frenzy. Getting the folks of Dyer Grove to go after the Mist Walkers. But we're against him. We're not going to be party to this. William Thompson! Alright, so uh, we want to open this safe, but obviously it's going to be super difficult. I mean, look at it! It's a safe! And what's over here? We have a videotape. More pictures. Ooh, that looks useful, and that looks super complicated. So we're gonna use this key over here on the shed. Windier. No! Trapped by icicles. And we just killed the power. Okay, well don't worry. I've got this thing. And this thing. Now the power is up and running. we can watch the videotape. Which is good, because watching videos was like half of the original video game. You as good as killed my wife, you and your tribe. She'd be alive if it was for you. What nonsense. You refused to help when I asked. She was one of us, Samuel. But you took her away. You made her an exile from the Mistwalkers. There was nothing we could do to help her. You're lying. Admit it, you just didn't want to help. Whoa, his wife used to be one of these mist walkers? That's pretty crazy, and the final piece of evidence... We'll, we'll, we'll eventually find that final piece of evidence. And car keys. So let's use the hint to get back to the car. Da -da 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 -da. Looks like wolves were trying to drive the car. Not very good, they didn't get too far because they're wolves. And wolves aren't good at driving. So this is a somewhat difficult puzzle. What you want to do is find matches. Of course, I have them all memorized now, but it's still very difficult to figure out on your own. It's like I have to move everything, and I think these are the stamps. And where am I going to find matches? There we go. So the final thing we find is the final thing we find is that record. Okay, gives us the music ring. Random. Uh, do, 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 do. over here. Who's Emily Thompson, by the way? Who who is Emily Thompson? I need to pick up this piece of evidence that the game is not letting me pick up. Here we go. Okay, so we have numbers on the wolves. I did pick up that piece of evidence, right? I did not. Not sure why that piece of evidence is so hard to pick up. So we're, we're finding the numbers on the various statues. So that gives us this number here, 346964, Nine, six, four. Seven, six, five? And that gives us the punch card so we can solve this monster puzzle. <laughs> 